These wheels. How many are there? Several. There's one on the roof too, over there. What do they do? I don't know. But leave them alone until the boss arrives. Ah, there are multiple cranks in the area. All right. Glad to know that now. Probably would have figured it out on our own anyways. Just trying to get up to this guy stealthily. That was close. Fraser, down. Hey, how you doing? Gotcha! Woo! Nice gun. Type 95. Sorry, I want to try out the gun! Type 95! Oh, that's Nadine. I was going to try and punch her. I think not, my friend. Uh-oh. Shotgun guys behind us. Shotgun guys get kind of scary. Uh, that instant death. Sorry for pushing out of cover, Nadine. Pistol guy's behind us. Gotta go punch him in the face. Ah, I changed my mind. Here, have a grenade. You are done. I think we're good. I think that's a lot of them. You alright? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more positive outlook, sort of. <laughs> okay. Let's go find our giant water faucet. Sounds good. Nadine is gonna want us to be super sneaky all the time, and that's not me. Sometimes, sometimes I gotta fulfill a bloodlust. Blood as far as she doesn't comment on us just shooting when there's nobody around. That's mostly because I like, uh, well, I wanted to test my gun out. What's this? I don't know. I've seen a few of them around. Well, I assume they're useful for something. You probably pull a switch and, like, they deploy into cranks or something. And then we gotta pull all the cranks and it'll, voila, open the door! So we gotta follow, or find, the master crank! Or master wheel or something. Maybe the door itself will have the answers. Sometimes... That's what we gotta keep an eye out for, right? Okay, that's not it. Know <laughs> this? What's the trick here? <laughs> what? Look like a button. Yeah, I just wanted you to have a go at something. <laughs> like I was staring dead center at the at the button as well. I was like, uh, why aren't we trying that? <laughs> here goes nothing. Oh, that's, that's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. Convenient. I gotta kneel down for it. Ugh. Whoa. What is this? Oh, it's just the same gun I have. Oh, that's fine. All right. I have more ammo for it. I will get some good snipes. And we'll have a good time. And how so about there should be about like five of these. That's two. I don't know where they all are, but I'm assuming a good couple of them will be up top, like over here. Here's another one. Three down. I guess Naughty Dogs didn't want to do the rule of three for this particular one. Sometimes games follow that really hardcore. They're like, eh, you do three things and the door will open all the time, everywhere. Makes things kind of uh, lacking. Not that I want to pull five different switches, but I'll take it. I can explore the environment a little bit. Surprised they didn't put any in here. Nice little covered up area. Okay. Well, I assume the other two will probably be on more high ground positions. Like way back here. See, they could have been like cranks. 
Then I, I could see them from a good distance away. Found you. Only one left. Yep, I just have no idea where that one is. But I'm kind of assuming it could be in this back direction. I could climb the elephant. And look at that, the elephant. Last but not least. Has the last switch. Should do it? Nice. Okay. Back to the big wheel thing. Big wheel thing? Whatever the archaeological term for it is. The big wheel thing works. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, I don't, I don't think there is a better term for it. Yeah, there probably is. But I'm not worried about it. Now can we spin it, or do we just press the button again? I want her to try pressing the button and then it doesn't work. Ah, no. Yep. Alright. Did. Oh, come on. Looks like we're going under. Radio. <laughs> not every door will be perfect. Try not to get crushed. <clears throat> not not gonna comment about how you almost died there. To the door. Actually, I guess there was a little bit of leverage. She probably would have been fine. Well, we probably don't have to worry about anybody in here. There's our faucet. <laughs> Faucet, I guess. We got another puzzle thing. Nothing. I'm guessing this one needs to look like a trident. Good guess. Okay. So before, and I, I guess I didn't really look at the other wheel too much. I thought it was already in like a perfect configuration, and then it messed up. I haven't been able to like go back and look at the footage. It could have still been that way, but I'm just now I know. I'm setting things up right. Oh, Easy pe oh a bit you bastard. What the heck? Does it not spin around? But the point goes over here. Okay. We gotta push it. Actually, I guess if it doesn't move, I can leave it like that. And then do this. Aha! It's Ganesh. Hello, sir. Hello, elephant Rock. face. Mr. Turn the water on. Well, well, what's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. <laughs> But it could be pretty cool if it was fire. I just don't think that would work out as well. Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh. I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. <laughs> Another waterfall. Yeah. It's two out of three now. Also, I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance. Representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand, on the outskirts of Halibadu. Pretty funny. Last stop. The fort embedded in that mountain. That'll be the one with the axe. Alright. Well, at least we can get least some resolution. Makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. 
Okay. Let's get out of here. I thought, um... Well, it'll be interesting. Now the thought is in my head that perhaps... Chloe's dad is the expert. Can we- can we even get this open? Let's try! <laughs> we're probably gonna get shot at, like, the moment we raise it up. Right. Alright, let's find a way out. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought him Maurice. You're no fun. <laughs> well, I mean, obviously you're not gonna be buying dinner out here, so once you're once we're through, you can you can save those MREs for another mission. Oh. Jesus! We shall see. Hello! Brothers, where are you? You see? Do a sweep! Ross and Fraser might still be here. They're dead! <laughs> Did not expect that. I don't mind if they see me taking out their friends. That was something. Hi, look out. Hey, how you doing? Uh, Just working in peripheral vision. But I guess you can't now. You're dead. Yeah, there's only like what one more guy Excuse you did you have a sniper rifle That is unpleasant I think Nadine killed the last guy oh No, no, she didn't oh shit. That's a big dude. Oh I missed oh fuck How'd you like the grenades slowpoke hey your helmet's gone all right. Pistol for the faster shots on his head. Oh, he's got a friend. Here you go. You know, with that grenade directly on you, it's impressive that you're still alive. But that's over. All right, we're clear. For real this time. You handed yourself off. What things are those? No real combat training. Ah. Slightly impulsive. Run around the field like a maniac. Need to learn what short, controlled burst means. Hey! Alright. And lost. Wearing red in a jungle combat scenario. I mean, seriously. You're wearing blue? There's not a hell of a lot that's blue when you're fighting in grass and stuff. You got the water, sure, but that doesn't really mean anything. Because we're not usually going to be <laughs> fucking doing commando level shit and chilling out in waterfalls waiting all day for the enemies to sneak by. Hey! Where's our car? Oh. I parked it in a very specific place that would have been very convenient for us. And then these jackasses moved it slightly ahead. Ugh. Okay, and... Here we go. Nope, well, we're still going for it. We're still trying to get it closer. Got it. Fill me up. What do we got? Ooh, a grenade launcher. Oh, but I barely used this. Uh, well, whatever, I guess. I can blow people up. That'll be special. That's just the one by the mountain left. Indeed. But there's still so much more we can check out. We have the, the axe place. Well, you still have all this stuff on the right. There's even a place that looks more towards the middle of the map. Just like over... above the giant X in the middle. So we gotta watch out for that. With that said, let's have fun driving down river! Oh, yeah. Ever since the young king lost to the Persians, everyone's wanted to lay claim to it, to this land. And here I thought we were just going on a treasure hunt. We are. Let men like Asav fight over it. It's 
none of our concern. Fighting wars was my concern for a time. Good point. But you did it for the cash. Usually. What about when you worked for Asar? <laughs> Definitely a cash grab. Hardly worth the trouble. Ouch. Why do it then? Needed to establish my rep, eh? Figured I'd start with the worst of the bunch. Nowhere to go but up after that. I mean, with all the different people who would hire mercenaries or in mercenary armies, I'm just gonna take a look around. you could probably go no, worse. Keep an eye out. But we haven't really had that much experience with Asav, so I don't know. <laughs> he's he's just villain, villain with army. Okay, I thought there'd be something up here. Cave over there. Oh, ah. I gotta go further up. At dip, dip. All right, hold up. Let's pull ourselves up a little bit so I can make the the leap. So I think I gotta jump to this first platform and try our luck from there. Oh jeez. Whoa! Thankfully, it doesn't just automatically lock us into sliding. Like just all the way down. That would suck. Okay. Do we got another token in here? I'm glad to see I brought a flashlight for us. Ah, nice. Can't hide from me. Another token for my collection. Nice. It's got a little piggy on it. Or boar. What's the difference? A lot. A lot of differences. Okay. I don't know how many tokens are in the game, but I, uh, more than likely won't find all of them. This was just like, I just kind of looked up, saw there was a structure, and went, huh, oh, that probably has something for us. Found anything? Found another token. Beautiful out here. I thought the car was about to start. Visit to India? Yeah. Not a lot of perks in this line of work, but travel is definitely one of them. Where have you been? Ah, oh, where haven't I been? Whichever question works for you. Well, I haven't been to the States. Really? Really? Yeah, well, the stuff I'm looking for is usually old, right? The US was only founded a couple of hundred years ago. True. What about you? Where do you want to go? Iceland. Nice choice. Beautiful there. Well, it's quiet. I'm spoiled. And I want to see those northern lights. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's on the bucket list, too. You should go when we're done here. Someday. Have other things to attend to first. Well, if you never attend the things on your bucket list, you might run out of time beforehand. I'm just gonna take a look around. Do what you have to do. What is up with all these bells here? Can I ring the bells with my gun? Trying to give away our position? Yes. <laughs> Sorry. I just... intrigued me. Seems to be a lot of these about. Still ringing. I don't have that many bullets, so I can't I can't ring every single bell unless I find another gun. I like Chloe's quick, cl uh, quick, quip back. Just yes. Oh, I legit have to shoot these, and I have a short amount of time to do it. Uh, how many of these are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wow, what a shame that I didn't shoot all of these in time. Well, shoot. Punch the bells. Punch them. I can't punch the bells. Well, there's a quicker way up over here. That's nice. So... I could shoot a grenade at that. Okay, then we go up and we ring the last bell with the grenade launcher. <laughs> I've got your brothers and sisters waiting for you. We probably could have blown the door up with a grenade launcher, but whatever, we we did it this way. Someone had to like Is there a quieter way to do that. 
Not turn up anything useful? We got a token. A fabulous token. This is a lot of effort for just a token. <laughs> right? Like someone allowed them to build this elaborate contraption just to put a coin behind a door. And what does it do? It's just a shiny coin. At least as far as we know. Hmm. What's up with those things over there? I imagine... I, sh I imagine insurgents, but... I see no insurgents. I'm just gonna take a look around. Alright, bye for now. <laughs> She's just like, eh, hey, okay. There's nobody around to shoot at us. So do what you gotta. Hmm, token again. Duly noted. Basically look for any structures on the map, and you'll be set up pretty well for these collectibles without needing to resort to Google. Not that I could do it if I wanted to, because I'm playing this pretty early on. Hello. Okay, I can't actually do that from here. Uh... Uh... Do I just pull? <laughs> I, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Uh -oh. oh, damn it. I need more leverage to move this. I could pull the car. Oh, this thing is stuck tight. I could pull it with the car. All right. Hey, Nadine. Need this. Just for a token. We got the winch. I'm just gonna take a look around. Happy hunting. Oh no, come on. All I'm right. just gonna take a look around. I'll wait here. We're gonna take the car over to this area, and I guess we have to get the rope attached to the front of this. The grappling hook, maybe? Get it. I'm just gonna take a look around. Do I'll it. Keep myself busy. That's what I'm assuming. I don't have the leverage for it, at least not with my bare arms. Also, I saw you statue back there. Whoops, I put my thing away. Shit. I jumped down while pressing O and I don't know which part got rid of that. I could also just do this. Must be a way to get more leverage. Maybe try using yourself as a counterweight. That's what I was trying to do. The brain's on you. Oh no. I'm really smart. I guess I could do like this. Oh! Hooray for physics. <laughs> okay, you get the the rope stuck on the little edge there, and I use my heavy weight to get rid of the lid. Nice. I also could have maybe just tried pulling the car. Uh oh. <laughs> boys, boys, boys! You don't need to be snarky. You're about to get blown up by a grenade launcher. That doesn't instantly blow up. Unless it makes direct contact with a person. Hold up. Blind fire grenade. Yeah, it didn't work out. I'm already in cover. We're clear. So, find anything down there? Got another token for our collection. Okay. Let's see if these guys brought anything to us. Did we move the car out of the way? Yeah, she did move the car really out of the way. Okay. Yes, they do have loot. I was about to just shoot the, the last grenade at this thing. Because <laughs> I know I'm probably just going to replace it. I blew up a bunch of people with it. It served its purpose. Also even got the chance to use it as a puzzle solver. Alright, just give me the full loadout. Oh, silence pistol will do. 
while you can fight. You can take things out as quietly as possible. Well. Duh! <laughs> I was going to say, well, it's on fire. <laughs> it's not going to do anything, and then it was going to, and I just blew up. Jeez. I guess I can't take pictures of these when I've already done the fortress. Or it's glitched out again. Hard to tell. Hard to tell. Let's get our car. This poor thing, we keep stomping all over it. But it's a rental! We don't own it. It's not up to us to fix it up. Hey, hold on. Damn it. The rebels took that site. We shouldn't stay on. So, we've been here, right? Ooh. Helmets. I got the headshot. It just doesn't matter if they have helmets. Where did you put that token you found? Did it somewhere safe? Did you tell us how? <laughs> no, I need to get something worthwhile out of this job. He will be angry if he finds out. <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm glad this game is super forgiving sometimes. I'm just like, boop, miss, miss, miss. They, so they took one of the tokens. Bastard. I gotta look around this area a little bit more then. Jerks, 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 jerks. And boop. I want a silenced assault rifle. And I could do some serious work to people. <laughs> Got it. All clear. Let's see what we've got here. All right, so he hid the token somewhere. I don't fully know where, but it's gotta be somewhere accessible to a guy that I'd assume is more on the lazy side. Oh, hey. Got an axe statue guy. Big X on this one. I beg your pardon. Big X. X haunting at that site. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Big X on this one. Well, I guess, uh, guess we know what she's looking at. Powerful weaponry. Now, uh, after this, maybe we can sell all this treasure and get Chloe some leg braces. Must be one of those tokens nearby. Yeah, too bad these guys took it. Shit, nothing here. They must have beaten me to it. Found anything? I think Asav's boys grabbed it. Well, they didn't get far. Maybe they stashed it somewhere. Good point. And I'm gonna hope that it's in one of these structures. Just buried under some rocks. And not like somewhere really, really crafty. Like just hidden in a bunch of grass. All the way in the back. Oh. Maybe they stashed it in that supply cart. That's what I was just thinking. Alright, let's see what we can get in here. I'm amused that all these crates usually may have only like one or two things in them, maybe three. I want a full armory worth of stuff in here. These boxes are big enough to carry a shitload of stuff. 
And they generally are, just most of it I can't use. Oh. Uh, well, alright. It's not in here. Shoot. It's on the back of this car. There could be other supply crates. Wow, only six bullets? Guess I'll have to actually preserve them. Or not. I wish I maybe could have left that guy alive a little bit longer. I'm not saying that I couldn't have, but I wish I did. Then maybe he could have led us there. He could have been like, Hold up, I need to check on my treasure. And then boom. We catch him in the act of staring off at a place. Oh, hey. Uh, another supply crate. If it's in this supply crate, I'm gonna be pretty, pretty annoyed. Because I have ran around for the last five minutes in many different places. And this is just right outside. Right, right near the place, and I didn't notice it. Ah, uh, shit. Wow. There you are. Find us keepers. Well, at least I got the token eventually. Oh, hey, another grenade launcher. I guess I could grab it again. But I do like shooting people with bullets a little bit more often sometimes, you know? If I could carry this and then another primary weapon, that would be perfect. Amazing. Just to have options. Maybe I want to snipe someone sometimes, but then fire up uh, with an assault rifle. I guess I could always kill a guy and then take his gun in the middle of combat, but... Eh. I mean, I went all around the place. I even went way down there, checking out the bushes and stuff. I'm like, where is this? I was in a truck. Just not even around a corner, just right away from it. Uh, okay, where am I? Ooh, if I keep going this way, I'll stumble across the mystery structure. Over there, in that cliff wall. See that archway? Looks intact. It should be fun. Hold on. Uh-oh. You coming with? I feel like stretching my legs. Nice, yo. We got rebel tech here. Rebel crates. So we're gonna need to get ready to fight. The question is, is it just gonna give you more silenced ammo? No. But, there is treasure in here. I haven't gotten a lot of those, honestly. This is more... <laughs> it's a miniature bronze cannon. Alright, it looked more like a baton. Ancient... It's just bronze baton. They just really didn't like when people tried to disrupt the law. 